delicious with the ice cream. Guess what? It is brownies. Chocolate brownies. And guess what? I got two new things at the store. I got measuring cups and tablespoon cups. Uh, measuring things and I got a tray for making brownies and now only that we have a special guest with us today one second and the special guest is Mr. Kapoor say hi Kapoor hi hey, out no okay now let's start making brownies So the first step is to chop some dark chocolate. I'm using about one and a half um, cube of chocolate, which is about 170 grams. Okay. So now I've chopped my chocolates and I have a boiled pot of water. And I will just keep this glass over. And we have a half cup of butter with us. We're gonna put this with the chocolate so they both can, you know, combine together and melt. So we get a nice gooey, chocolatey, kind of like cream. Yes. So in a separate bowl, Add one cup of sugar, half a cup, uh, half a cup brown sugar, and we need three medium-sized eggs. We're gonna just crack it. Not all three together individually. We gotta crack it and we gotta mix it and do repeat the step again and again. Okay, I've added all three eggs and now I'm going to keep mixing till the batter gets a bit fluffy and a bit creamy at the same time. Mix, mix, mix. My hands are getting tidy and Kupu's kind of starting at me a bit weird. Okay, my hand is like really tired right now. So next we're going to add one fourth teaspoon salt and one teaspoon vanilla now let's mix it so after we combined well the salt and the vanilla essence we got to add the chocolate butter mix in and you gotta mix it okay now we have to sieve half cup all-purpose flour and one fourth cup cocoa powder now let's see it Now I'm done sieving the all-purpose flour and the cocoa powder. Now we gotta add one fourth cup of walnuts. You should not powder it too much. They gotta be a little bit of teeny weeny pieces that here and there, so the brownie could be just perfect. Now let's gotta mix. We gotta mix it. Okay, now our batter is ready. So now we're gonna grease our pan with some butter. Now I played, uh, place the parchment paper in here and we're gonna add a brownie batter in here. So now the batter has fully set and it's fully flat. Now I'm gonna add Drakika cut uh, uh, walnuts at the top. Now 
we have to keep this in the oven. So now I have preheat, heated the oven for 180 degrees Celsius. And now let's keep a brownie in here. Now it has been 30 minutes and the whole house smells delicious like brownies and see even Kupu is glued to the kitchen right now. Okay now let's take the brownies. Oh the aroma! Yummy! Mm, it smells like so good. Wait let me off the oven because I'm scared I might get burned. I wish you guys can smell it, you know. It smells delicious. I can't wait to eat it now. I'm so excited. I think I'm going to be a great chef all over the world. Wish me luck. Okay, now we're going to let this cool down so we can chop it in slices and we can eat it. So now guys, the brownie has fully cooled down and the only step now we have is to cut it into small pieces. So it's night time now, I really want a desert right now. So we are going to make some sizzling brownies with ice cream. We are going to take this to the next restaurant level. We have the sizzling plate here, heated, it's like very very hot, don't touch it. We are going to take it with this thingy, be very careful of you guys. Slowly and keep it over here. Okay. Now I packed and I have wrapped all of my brownies individually. So we're gonna open it. And now we need ice cream. I'll just go get some ice cream. So I have my ice cream here with me. We're gonna take a big scoop. We're gonna just keep it at the top. Just like that. Some chocolate sauce with me. And we're gonna put it Ooh, hear the sound? It's 